And with the shortage of vaccines, some new research is offering a potential way to free up supply. Give people who have recovered from COVID just one dose, not two. Our ABC 10 News anchor Derek Stahl is going in depth on those findings. When the vaccines started rolling out, doctors across the country started noticing a trend. People who had recovered from COVID seemed to experience more intense side effects than others to the very first dose. Just the other day, I was in the hospital and I talked to one of my colleagues who unfortunately had COVID a few months ago. He got the shot and he said, wow, it really knocked him out. New research on 230 patients showed those with existing antibodies to the virus were roughly twice as likely to report fatigue after the first shot than those who had never been infected. They also experienced significantly higher rates of headache, chills and fever. Dr. Mark Sawyer of Rady Children's Hospital isn't surprised since those side effects are a sign your body's immune system is jumping into action. So we know that second doses of the vaccine have more side effects. This is essentially the same as that. that vaccination after infection is just like having a second dose of vaccine. The researchers behind the study then took things a step further and analyzed antibody responses. This new paper and actually several others like it is very interesting because it does show the levels of antibody that you get if you've had COVID once and then you just get a single booster are basically on par with people that have gotten two doses. And maybe not just on par. The research showed people who had recovered from the virus produced 10 times more antibodies after just one shot than an unexposed person produced after two shots. Now, there's no change in policy yet. And part of that is because we don't really know exactly what level of antibody you need to be fully protected. But it's interesting and it makes sense to me that, you know, people already have seen COVID and already have some degree of immune protection. You might just need a single booster dose. Some experts are calling on the CDC to go to a one dose policy for COVID survivors to free up potentially millions of shots. But others say it might be tricky to confirm people's past infection status. And the data on all this is thin. I don't think we have enough data on the single dose following infection to know whether that is going to be good enough. Uh, so I don't think we're ready to make that recommendation. For now, the CDC recommends that every eligible person get two doses of the mRNA vaccines, including COVID survivors. But the CDC says COVID survivors should wait at least 90 days after their illness to start the regimen. Derek Stahl, ABC 10 News.